Hey, what's going on YouTube? Marine X back at it again. This is the worst EDC pen that I've ever purchased. Let's just get right to it. This is the Big Idea Design collaboration with Carryology. They came up with a boat action pen. So let's talk about the good parts. Let's talk about the bad parts. Let's talk about my recommendation, whether you should spend your money on it. And let's talk about why I came up with those summation. So first of all, this is Big Idea Designs normal boat action pen, which is a CNC machined EDC pen. It looks, you know, their normal pen actually looks pretty nice. I don't own the normal pen, so I can't give you an opinion on that. I just know I like Carryology. Also like this Japanese inspired design you see on the bottom here. So that's one thing I liked about it when I saw it online. I like Carryology, the bags they offer, the advice they offer. So, you know, I thought that this might be a great collaboration. So this one is their stone wash option. Um, so it's the titanium pen in the stone wash. The grip itself is kind of a it's a rubbery filling grip, but it's not really made of rubber, but it still doesn't feel very durable. The uh, pocket clip is a, a reversible, very deep uh, pocket clip, and it has the Carryology and the Big Idea Designs logo right there. It has a little orange. Uh, for the actual boat it's orange the top is orange and you can access it with a little torx key but it's really easy to change this thing out you know you just kind of unscrew it and you can replace it with all sorts of uh, canisters the fisher space pen it's it's so it is pretty versatile in that aspect which you don't have to buy big idea design proprietary uh, refills to refill this thing so it comes with a very standardized um pressurized refill so you can use this with like a right in the rain refill if you want to use this like a right in the rain pen which would allow for you to write sideways upside down all that good stuff so it does have a few things which are nice about it it's about five inches in length has a decent grip to it i'm not the biggest fan of how it how it feels when you're writing but it does have a nice link to it if you get this standard so i mean big idea designs already has some pricey items but this thing comes in at 149 dollars so that's my first negative 149 bucks. Yeah, it is titanium, but there's there's companies putting out boat action pens for cheaper than that, which are American made. This is not gives you more of a secure feeling in the use of this thing. So that's one thing I'm not a big fan of. I don't usually do the big comparison with their competitors. But if you look here, I have the tactile turn boat action pen. Nice long link. This one's in there. Stainless steel. Ninety nine dollars. American made nice and machine feels way better in quality just feels incredibly premium even the tactile turn pencil uh, side action pencil this one's made of their brass incredible filling on there i can even go with like the cheap amazon brand this is by refine this one i think comes in at like 60 bucks on amazon this feels better than the big idea design uh you know and it's about the same length you know and it comes in at half the cost we can bring in bastions boat action pins bastions pins you can always find these on a special you can grab these on amazon between you know 69 89 bucks just depending on how much they cost this thing is this copper feels incredible and it has a great weight to it and it just feels more sturdy these are also better to write with the tactile turn the refine the bastion um i probably would say that the the big idea design writes better than the bastion but the tactile turn much better so for me personally once i spend over a hundred dollars on a pen i expect a hundred dollars over a hundred dollars in you know features so this big idea design just a a, a titanium pen stone washed in color you know so that's cool and all let's look at this tactile turn premium zycranium and if i'm saying that wrong my bad the entire pen is made out of that $199 for this pen here, but it, it's incredible. It's a talking piece. This is a unique pen. Your buddy's not going to have anything like this. You know, easy to access here at the bottom, but you can't even see that. Like, look how seamless the bottom is. You couldn't even tell that's where you access the ink at the very bottom down there is by unscrewing that. And so just high quality uh, features a, a nice longer length this is the standard length for the big idea designs they have one that's even smaller than this they call their mini you know so you're paying 149 dollars basically for the name big idea designs is already kind of pricey and you pair that with Carryology. 
I think that this is overpriced, not worth it. In my opinion, don't spend your money on the big idea designs. If you want to get something that's kind of in the premium realm, I would advise you to take a look at the tactile turn, even take a look at refine, take a look at bastion. There's a lot of made in America pens, higher quality, feel better in the hand. I think they write better and I just wouldn't waste my money on the big idea design. But hey, tell me what you think, man. Let me know your opinion down below. Did I miss this one? Is, do you agree with this one? You tell me to kick rocks. Love to know your opinion down below. Listen, if, if you are not a part of the battalion, we would love to have you a part of the battalion. Hit that subscribe button below and join us. We would love to have you. If this is your first time here, thank you for stopping by. For everyone else, we'll speak soon.